Hey guys, thanks for joining me again tonight. Okay, so this isn't really actually a bath bomb demo. This is just something crazy that I thought of in my head, and this is really just, honestly, just for my sheer amusement. So, um, this is what I have tonight. Just, a, you know, giant plastic cauldron with um, some bath bomb dust in it. Yeah, um, I was shopping at Target just for some Halloween decorations, and I saw this, and most people would probably think, you know, put candy in it, give it to your kid for trick-or-treating. Trick it actually said um, punch bowl on it, which is kind of small for punch bowl, but, you know, I immediately thought bath bomb. Um, so, I called up Danielle from Something Wicked, and I said, hey, I need a lot of bath bomb dust. I'm going to try and put some in this big plastic cauldron and make a huge cauldron bomb, even though I know that's not how they're made. They're just not shoved with bath bomb dust in them, but you know, I'm going to try and do it just to see what happens. Um, you know, why not? So that's what we're going to do tonight. And so she made me purple and black and green. And instead of just putting them all in there at once, I decided, well, let's just do one color at a time and see how that works. And uh, so I'll obviously have to stop the camera and dry it off and, you know, do one layer at a time. But still, I think, um, I think what's going to happen, and I could be totally wrong, I think that when the water hits it, I think it's going to blow up like one of those huge volcanoes you made when you were a kid with the baking soda and the vinegar and just whoo, kind of explode once and that'll be it. And I think that'll happen on every layer maybe. So um, I wanted to see that kind of three times maybe instead of just once. But anyway, um, this is kind of an awkward position. I'm gonna try to adjust maybe my camera or whatever, a little bit more, I don't know. Um, but anyway, that's what we're doing tonight. So uh, I guess stick around if you wanna see what this does. It could be a disaster. Um, it could be funny, who knows. So um, it could be cool looking, we'll see. So um, hang on just a sec and we'll get started. All right, let's see what this can do. I gotta push it under because it's not heavy enough because it doesn't have anything in it to get some water in it. And then maybe when it gets filled up with water, ah, come on, come on, come on. Then I'll do something. Okay, come on. It's huge. Y'all, the water is black. Oh, I love it. I love it. This is awesome. <laughs> oh, see, now I think that's it, though. I think that's the big show, but I mean, that's worth it, right? It's awesome. Okay, let's see. fun that was fun even though it didn't want to go under because um, it just was so light okay let's check out this water instant black awesome okay let's go to color number two <laughs> okay so I hated to take my phone off the tripod because I don't want to keep moving you guys around, but look at the pattern on this water. It is so, so cool looking. It kind of looks like, it's kind of like the colors are like, they're in like little shatters or something. I don't know, like the pattern is so cool. Um, honestly too, there is a little like purple to this water. It's not like solid black like I thought it was originally, but um, oh, it's so, so cool. Okay, and I didn't tell you either, um, that scent was brown sugar and it smelled really, really, really good. So anyway, that's what this water looks like. So now we're going to do the green. So let me get this set back up and we'll do that. Okay. 
Okay, so I have the green ready, and this is scented in what she called a fruity citrus, and I think it smells like green apple, like really tart green apple, and I think it smells really, really good, like a, a green apple candy. So um, I can't wait to see what this looks like. Um, let's just do it, let's just do it. I can't wait to see that again. Now I know I have to push it under a little bit, so. A little bit more water. All right. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. Oh, look at the green. It is so bright. That's awesome. Oh my gosh. I think I can maybe get a little bit more out of there. <laughs> yeah, this, when I said this is for my amusement, I was not kidding. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad I did this. I'm so glad. <laughs> this is hysterical. I mean, somebody has a good idea and then just other people just go nuts with it, you know? Look at the rings, look at the sun. Look at, look at the gorgeous, look at the, oh, so awesome. Oh, and the smell's so good too. There might be some more in there, I can't tell. I think that might be it. Oh, it's heavy, Ugh. oh my goodness. Oh my God, oh my God. Oh my gosh, that is so heavy. Oh, okay, I'm pouring the rest of it out. Oh. I don't know how big this thing is. I mean, compared to, I mean, this is how big it is in my hands. I mean, it's huge for my bathtub, obviously, but um, I mean, when it's filled with water, it's heavy. Look at those colors, oh, it's awesome. It's so awesome for Halloween. It's just perfect, absolutely perfect. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to. Yeah, I'm gonna have to um, take some more pictures. I'll be back in just a second. Okay, now this looks like something out of Ghostbusters or something. This is so bright, and just the different colors and the bubbles, and it's just so thick. The foam. It looks like. Um, it looks like a Slimer was in here for sure. Oh, look at that. That's gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I love this. Like I wanna do the next one, but I don't wanna mess this up. This bath art is gorgeous. That's awesome, that kinda of looks like algae. All right, so I'm kind of sad this is the last color. Look how bright this purple is, it's so bright. Um, so there was a little pink in here too, but I kind of squished up um, the bigger pieces and now it just all looks purple. Now this is her unicorn farts scent and she has a unicorn tears balm and I'm sure it's in the same, it's in the same scent. And this is, she calls it a, just a sweet kind of candy scent. I think it's pretty, um, I think it's like kind of a sweet tart scent, which is really, really nice. And this apple smells, I'm calling it an apple. The green smells really, really good. And I think that this will go really good with that. So, um, oh, I think that this is going to be so pretty. So, um, Let's just, let's just do this one too. Let's see what it looks like. Let's see. Ah! <laughs> oh my God. Oh, it's so pretty, oh my gosh. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh, it's so gorgeous that green around the outside, 
purple is so, so bright. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. Okay, let's dunk it one more time. Oh, it's so pretty though. Okay, let's dunk it one more time. Let's see if it's got any left. And I do see the pink in it. Do you guys see the, the pink in there? Oh, look at that bath art. Oh my goodness. Can't hold that anymore. Oh well. Wow. Oh. oh my goodness, it's just absolutely gorgeous. Okay. Who let's oh my goodness gracious. Okay, it's picture time, you guys. Oh my gosh, I have never, that's probably the prettiest bath art I've ever seen. Honestly, that's, that's probably the best. That's amazing. Okay, let's start with the middle that is still going off. The little chunks, they're still going off down there. Over here. And then his outer rings, the purple and the green. You still see that black just very faintly around the outside. Oh, that is so awesome. So, what did I say? I had 42 ounces of this stuff in here? So that's just insane. So, no wonder it's got gorgeous bath art, but obviously, um, I got some good stuff. She did really, really awesome for me. I really, really appreciate this. So I'm going to give her all the credit for this. Thank you, Danielle. This is freaking awesome. This is really awesome. I do not want to turn these jets on because this is just way too pretty. I'm going to look at this for a few more minutes. All right, so this is the final watercolor. I let it die down a little bit. I let the foam die down, and I've taken on my Instagram pictures. So this is what it looks like close up. It's a dark green. We're gonna call this um, like a witch's brew green. I think it's awesome the color that this turned out. And what you're seeing is kind of, um, that's better. Um, what you're seeing is um, a little bit lighter than it is. It's it's a dark green, but it's really awesome. I love it, it's perfect. So um, yeah, let's just turn the jets on and um, we'll see if it makes some bubbles. I guarantee you we're gonna get some bubbles out of this. So let's just check and see. We'll probably get a lot of bubbles, honestly. And this smells so good. So the brown sugar was the first scent, and then what did I say, like a tart green apple scent and then just kind of like a sweet, sweet tart candy scent. So it smells really good, kind of just sweet and candy, fruity tartness um, all over the bathroom. It smells really strong and really good, which is just so perfect for me. And I did ask her to make something, you know, kind of sweet and fruity, you know, stay in those families. So it's just absolutely perfect. I just, I couldn't be happier. So. I just really appreciate her doing that for me. Just kind of going with my crazy idea, but yeah, we've got all kinds of bubbles. So let's just let's just get a little closer and look at those. Oh yeah, very very nice and soft. Just fluffy fluffy bubbles. Lots of fluffy bubbles. See back there, they're getting even higher than the seat. That's so awesome. So I better just stop these because um, they might get out of control. So I can get in there and they won't 
like overtake me, but um, it's just awesome. I think it's I think it's just awesome. All right, well, um, I'm gonna get in here and I'm gonna let you guys know how it was when I get out. All right, guys, so I'm done with my, I'm gonna call it my something wicked brew. Um, oh, that was so awesome. There's a little bit of um, bath bomb dust and some shimmer down there. I couldn't really see it in the water, but there's shimmer all over me. It's awesome. It's like iridescent shimmer. Um, this was so nice. This was so much fun. Um, tell me if you guys enjoyed this and my shenanigans. I'm, I'm very interested to know if y'all enjoyed it as much as I did, but it was just a lot of fun. It was a really nice bath. It was super, super moisturizing. I actually had to be careful that I didn't slip getting in and out of there. So um, it was really moisturizing. It had shimmer. It was an awesome show. Thank you so much, Danielle, for um, acquiescing to my crazy request. I really appreciate it. Um, definitely go check out her shop. I'm going to put her links below. But um, I appreciate y'all joining me for another Halloween bath bomb video, even though it really wasn't a bath bomb demo. And um, I guess I'll just see you guys next time, but I really appreciate you watching. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.